Hey Kickstarter, this is Jonathan from Ridgewood Watch Company. Just wanted to run through a couple of features or a couple of uh, experiences on both the phone and the watch. We're gonna go through the installation of the app and I'm also gonna go through software updates over the air. So let's start with installation. We're gonna start off with a brand new uh, iPhone 5S and uh, we're going to install the app for the first time. So welcome. First thing we need to do is ask for permissions to send notifications to the app itself. Now we need to look for the device, so make sure it's fully charged, make sure it's in range. And we can see there it is. Now you'll see that there are six zeros next to the name LifeClock, that's the serial number. Each LifeClock one will be serialized for each individual backer, so the serial number should match the backer ID in terms of where you back the campaign in the queue. That's it, we're paired. We get a welcome screen. Let's follow that orange line. That's it, we're up and running. So now let's go through software updates. When there's a new update for the watch, not the app on the phone, but the watch itself, you'll get a push notification on the app telling you that there's an update. You'll jump to software update. it will tell you there's an update available. Now we're going to go into a debug screen at the moment. And when you hit update, you'll see the watch will automatically start updating and the update will be applied over Bluetooth. Now the watch has a few checks and balances to make sure that the operation is successful. It needs to have a certain minimal battery charge level. And also, if an incoming call comes in during the update, the update should continue, at least on iOS. And if the operation is interrupted, the watch can recover so that you're not left with a watch that can't operate. So let's just fast forward to the end. And that's it, the watch is up to date. So that's it for now. Um, we will be back with some more updates, both on the watch and on the app. We'll include some Android updates. And once again, thank you so much to all our backers so far for all the support. It's fantastic. Keep it up and we'll be back in touch soon.